entire career, the goal was to win the Olympic Games. And that was very clear. And that's how we would run our days and our weeks and our months and our years, is if it helped us win the Olympic gold, then we would do it. Tessa Virtue and Scott Moyer become the second couple to win two Olympic gold medals in ice dance. Not having that common goal and that kind of singular focus uh, is, is different for me and it's, it's harder to uh, kind of adjust to. Mm -hmm. I don't know if it's, you feel no, like that. No, it's a huge challenge. I think, I mean, the entire structure of our lives has changed and in some ways that pressure has lifted, which is nice and I, oh, yeah. I feel that. You know, I'm grateful every day to not wake up with that. <laughs> like, too. it's intense. I loved it. I love it every second of it, but uh, it's, 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 time. it's tough. And so in some ways it's really liberating and in a lot of other ways it's scary and difficult to maneuver, you know, what comes next. But I'm also realizing the more I talk to people, the more I realize that's what everyone is dealing with. Everyone yeah. is looking for the next goal, is searching for a purpose. Everyone is kind of transitioning in some facet of their life. And I think that's the nature of the beast. And we may have done it on a different scale or in front of the, you know, in the public eye, but it's still the same. Those feelings um, are inherently human. And I think that's what you know, is in a way refreshing to know that we're not alone in that. It's really only natural now that we're skating a little bit less and training less, that there's more time to pursue those avenues individually. But we love those projects that bring us back together. Yeah, it's fun to come back together then. Yeah. You know, Things not like that it wasn't before. It's not like that, but it's just like you realize, you know, a little time apart doing different things where you're working with partners that aren't quite the same, mm -hmm. and you come back together into great relationship that we've established for 21 years, mm -hmm. so it's pretty fun. I don't know, I find it uplifting like when I see you doing uh, a shoot or like having a dress uh, on a Barbie doll, which is amazing, like I'm genuinely happy, like a lot of things we did together because we were sold as Virtue Moyer and it's just natural time for it Same. to kind of, yeah. yeah. Seeing photos and hearing about you coaching that seminar or things, Yeah, it's you just, know, it's, yeah, always, it's always nice, we support each other and sometimes it's from a distance and sometimes it's from side by side. It's tough to narrow down um, so many sessions and years of work that we've done on our in our relationship that we've invested so much in. Um, you know, our, our partnership, our business partnership, and um, and also growing up together. It's, it's a complicated relationship. So, but the biggest thing is, and we got a lot of power from this, I'd say, in the last four or five years of our career, is having that open communication, that open dialogue, and um, you know, if you have a feeling, sharing it and and finding a solution to it together, and, and the power of being maybe a little bit vulnerable. Mm. I think we found a lot in that, and uh, we were able to kind of take some of our fears and and at least handle them in a different way because we had the strength of bouncing them off each other. Yeah. yeah, that's true, there is power in that, and sometimes just starting those difficult conversations um, is daunting, but we, we learned we're always better when we communicate and we talk openly, and, and we're, often approaching things from a different place, but we have such respect for how one another operates in things, and, and that sort of fundamental um, trust, yeah. I think, and, and safe place within the partnership has served us really well. And we continue to work on it, too. Yeah. Like, I think that's the, the one of our messages, too, that we tell young people, or, um, especially young ice dancers, or something. Like, you have to continue to work on that relationship. There's, there's no such thing. I think people see us at our high moments at the Olympic Games where, of course, when we triumph together, it's easy to, mm -hmm. you know, high five and hug and be yeah. so happy for one another. But there's a lot of work behind that, mm -hmm. and you have to continue to work on that. And, um, yeah, we're, we're proud of the work that we've done in the relationship. Mm -hmm. I think when you know that you're each other's biggest fans and fundamentally that you support one another in every capacity, it makes it easier to broach certain subjects or to, to share, to open up, because everything else is just superfluous. Like we just, we know that when we come together, we're, we're united. <laughs>